I'm Don Nelson. Here are your top headlines. Motive Power is shutting down its Boise plant. It's a story we first brought you this morning. Company officials said today that the Southeast Boise plant will be shut down either by the end of this year or the beginning of next year. The company will be moving its operations to Pennsylvania. Motive Power manufacturers and overalls locomotives, the company won't say how many Boise workers will be affected by the shutdown, but it says workers will be offered benefits and severance packages. A stretch of downtown Boise may see some big changes soon. Boise Dev reports that the Capital City Development Corporation has voted to spend almost $11 million to revamp two sections of Grove Street. The main work will be done from 6th Street at the Basque Block all the way down to Broadway Avenue. It also includes putting in some new pedestrian paths and officials emphasize that this plan is still preliminary. Completion could be some five years down the road. Now, Chief Meteorologist Scott Dorval with the On Your Side forecast. Chilly temperatures in the Cherish Valley today only hitting 66. It was dry most of the day, but the rain showers have moved in this evening and they're moving in from north to south. Check them out on Doppler radar here, pu pushing in just after 530 and going from south to north again. That's the motion. This is the way these showers are going. Look at this one near Boise, which is tracking just about over uh, West Boise, heading towards the Flying Y. That's going to be some heavy rain coming in. So Boise, Meridian, Nampa and east of Caldwell getting hit with some heavy rain and these will continue to track across the interstate as we move through the rest of the evening. Here's that closer inspection of that heavier rain on the west side of Meridian. It's pouring now and there's also it's some tracks of some hail, uh, some pea sized hail that occurred with the showers just to the west. All responsible for this is a storm system down to the south, low pressure as it moves on away. It will eventually take those showers away, but it will bring the wind in tomorrow. A blustery, chilly afternoon only in the 60s. It will be drying out with sunshine, but the wind will make it feel colder. That wind will settle down for a very chilly chilly, a very chilly Saturday morning, but a beautiful afternoon near 70 with light wind, milder and 77 on Sunday. We could be above 70 into the middle part of next week as well. There's my updated forecast. Another update coming right here later this evening.